got one more for you called In the Dark, Romance in the Dark. In the dark, baby, it's Hi, just you my name is Katherine Davis. Welcome to 594 side. Miles from Chicago. And not one side, just a beat of my poor heart, baby. Preserving the history of the blues is so that our future generations will have a better understanding of how this country was developed. All the performers who have performed have paid contributions through music by telling their stories about life's experiences. The downfalls, the good times, the, the dismay from uh, good and bad or bad relationships, uh, racism, sexism, discrimination. I agreed to do it because I felt like I'm, I'm giving something to the blues industry to help it, help people have a better understanding about the blues and how valuable it is and the performers that perform this music, everybody that's involved, the blues clubs, the museums, the record companies, you know, everybody that's involved in the blues, it's because they want to be involved in it. It's, it's not like, you know, you have to do it. You want to do it and because you know how valuable it is. In the dark. It's very important to preserve the history of the blues because it has uh, shown what it represents anyway with all the many performers uh, who have uh, performed and recorded and traveled around the world playing the blues and how it has made people happy and make people want to learn more about history, our history to show more respect to the blues, keep the blues into the music industry, and, and, and let it known that it's, it's just as important as in any of the other forms of music. They have to keep it alive by taking care of themselves first and taking care of themselves so that they will be able to take care of the blues. Uh, because there's, you know, we got our phones, we, got, we have communication where we can watch uh, blues bands performing. Any artist that pretty much that you want to watch, you can watch it on YouTube, okay? You can, uh, we can't go to the museums right now, but we can only utilize what we have. If you play an instrument, or you wanted to play an instrument, now's your time. For me, I said it's now or never. You know, learn, teach myself how to play the piano. Don't beat myself up. And that's one thing, we can't beat ourselves up right now. You know, we ain't supposed to do it anyway. But right now, you just look at all your greatest potentials. And this is not the time to judge or be judged, or not to accept judgment from anyone. Focus on if you like to play, or you want to play an instrument, they got all that on YouTube where you can teach yourself. It's about teaching yourself now until we are able to get back together and teach, learn and teach what we learn and try and teach it to the younger generations. Yeah.